I'm here with Peter Tyson of the ZDF, and um, we're talking about the China Symposium today. As a as a journalist, um, I know that this this theme has been really important in the in the media recently. Can you speak a little bit about why you think that this this topic has been so widely reported? So we are we are just before the Frankfurt Book Fair. So the book fair is always a big topic, and I think this year it is especially uh, political. Uh, because China is the, the, the guest country of uh, this year's book fair and uh, that's why we have a focus on uh, German-Chinese topics and uh, so there were, there, were, there, were, there were some problems in front of uh, the event today because uh, two authors, uh, one from China, one from uh, one who lives in the United States uh, were invited first and then uh, the invitation uh, was, was rejected again, so we didn't know till the last moment will they come, will they not come. So uh, they bought, it seems, their own tickets and, and came here and it was very interesting to see how will be the, the meeting together of the official Chinese delegation and these two others who, who are more in the opposition. Mm -hmm. And do you think that this meeting went well or uh, badly? How do you think it went today? I think it was a, a, a very bad start because uh, it seems that, that this, the schedule uh, was not held like, like it was planned and uh, so the offic official Chinese delegation uh, was somehow um, angry about this changing of the program and when one of the, one of the dissidents uh, uh, spoke in front of the public they just left, uh, um, left the room mm -hmm. so everything went... Um, how can I say, uh, everything Downhill. was mixed up and, and uh, nothing was like, like planned and I think it was a very difficult job for the, the president of the, of the German book fair as he had to run after the delegation of China and had tried to convince them to come back and then again we had this discussion uh, how important uh, is, is freedom of speech for example for us, for us and uh, can we really do this, can, can we run behind uh, Chinese delegation because they leave the room and say sorry we are so sorry and you have to come back and so we are in this very diff difficult field of um, uh, we have to speak with Chinese official delegation um, but but we cannot we cannot um, say okay you can do whatever you want and if you don't want these people to speak we just leave the room because that's not right either so um, I think this 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 is the main topic here um, we have um, this democratic tradition of uh, freedom of speech mm -hmm. and on the other hand we want to talk with the officials as well and we know that the uh, human rights in China don't play the same role as, as in, in Germany. Mm -hmm. So I think we, here at this event we have this, this special focus on, on this topic and um, we see in a very small room now the, the problems of the world somehow. Yeah. Do you expect more problems like this at the book fair itself? Yeah, I think the book fair will be a very uh, difficult one this year because you cannot exclude these uh, problems of human rights from, from uh, this year's book fair because Ch China is the main partner of, of this year's book fair. So we will see a lot of people uh, from China who will try to, to, to hold free speeches and so on and then we have these officials uh, mm -hmm. who want to prevent them from doing this. So I think there will be a lot of problems this year. Do you find it difficult to be objective when you're reporting stories like this? No, as for me, it's, I think it's not, it's not difficult to be objective because here we are in a free country, so uh, we can see the, the, the two sides and um, of course um, I, I see a little bit of a problem in, in the way that the journalists uh, report about this topic because we always try to find uh, the bad things uh, about the, the Chinese, of course, and, and mm -hmm. today they gave us an example and it's very easy to, to accuse them of running out of, of the room. And, but we also have to take into account that they have different um, traditions and, and different kinds of um, uh, participating in such events. So on the one hand, I can understand that they left the room because the mayor of Frankfurt, she just addressed the, the, uh, the people from the opposition in China and she didn't greet in the same way the official delegation of China. For them, it was total, totally um, uh, total um, annoyance. Mm -hmm. you say? Annoyance. So I think this is um, this is why they left the room also. And um, 
But again, you see how difficult it is to, 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 to deal with the Chinese uh, officials. Mm -hmm. Great. Thank you so much for your opinion.